Hello, the practitioner here. Uh, this time I'm in, uh, I'm in here as my magician capacity. Um, Penn Gillette uh, once again has made a very good point about certain lobby groups who are censorship and afraid of violence. Um, I will tell you about an incident that nearly happened to me. Um, I nearly once actually got arrested um, for, uh, well, actually, no. Uh, let me put it this way. I nearly got actually expelled from Camelson College, um, and this was just almost a year ago, for having taken a knife and gone to the nursing department, stabbed myself, did a qigong quote-unquote breathing technique, and when I pulled it back out, I was completely fine. As in, I was completely invincible, there was no blood, no nothing. I was doing this in an attempt of trying to find the head of the nursing department, who I absolutely had no idea who it was, to try to debunk alternative medicine. This was the worst possible backfire. They thought, um, now of course, I hadn't really been thinking about the, uh, you know, it had been badly timed, inappropriate, you know, <laughs> right idea, wrong time. Um, for two reasons. One of which it was not in a proper um, uh, demonstration against it to alternative medicine, like a full-scale presentation. And number two of which of the fact was that uh, in the local news where I live, uh, a guy in Oak Bay, uh, which is a little um, municipality close to here, uh, had actually uh, killed two of his family with a knife. Uh, he had killed his entire family with a knife and then suicided. Um, so needless to say, there was a lot of concern about stabbing people with knives. Anyway, not only did my plastic uh, magician's knife get confiscated, but this baby here also got confiscated, and I had to buy a second one. So it's for your viewing pleasure tonight. I will attempt to dismember myself on camera, and um, I hope you will enjoy. Um, I'm going to, again, use that same technique, which allowed me to be immune from harm before, and I'm going to attempt it for you here. I should mention, I'm going to uh, do this vaguely, okay? This is a real blade, okay? You can see I'm pulling against it in both directions, and I'm doing this lightly. You can see that it's pressing here. I do not want to slice my finger off. I will get something, however, be right back. I will go get something that I can slice with this to demonstrate that this is, in fact, a real knife. Okay, let's see. Here is a sprig of spinach. I will now stick it through the uh, chopper here. And I'd like you to observe the fact, uh, let me turn it around for you so this way you can see. You see it got bent out of the way? Here, let me put it through again with the blade up here and let's slice it through, okay? Again, you can see that there's a very small part hanging out the front here. And you see, it slices into two bits. Mmm, tasty. This is a real knife blade, okay? Not to be toyed with. So what I'm going to do now is I'm now going to attempt to slice my finger off. This is probably going to hurt like hell, but I hope to God it doesn't go um, too problematic. I'm going to use the same words, umba bimba shulumbala, which I used from before in the hopes of remaining invincible. One, two, ow! But lo and behold, as you can see, my finger has not been sliced off. It is still completely fine. Here, look. Uh, again, I will show you. Remember, this is a real blade, okay? This is the blade right here, the little uh, shiny thing you see in the center of the circle. It is a real blade, and you can see my fingers in here. Like I said, you can see little bits of it. This is a real blade. I do not want to slice my fingers off. So I will take it up to the top again and try to slice my fingers through while remaining invulnerable to harm. One, two, three. Ow! Oh, but lo and behold, see my finger is completely fine. I have nearly cut off my finger three consecutive times doing this trick before. Um, like I said, let's just consider it lucky that um, I've been able to do so well. So for my next trick, um, I'm going to uh, uh, hang on, uh, hang ten for a minute, because I'm going to go attempt to find a knife to kill myself with. Okay, here we go. This is a standard knife. Okay, one, two, three. Ah, ow, ah, shit. Fuck, fuck, ow, 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 ow. No blood. The knife is completely clear, and I am invincible to harm.
I have been able to stab myself through. One of these days, you should watch as I slice my own throat. Um, I'll probably have to do that with, uh, like I said, I'll probably slice my own throat one of these days with a knife, and I will show you that I can actually slice myself. And just so you know, this is a real knife, okay? Uh, here, let me uh, get a piece of paper here, which I don't need. See this? See, it's actually cutting into the paper. You can see there's a bit of a cut right there. That's the cut right there. This is a real knife, okay? Do not take lightly. Do not try this trick at home. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed. Those are my tricks of attempting to bodily dismember myself. And, uh, you know, I'll probably, chances are, I'll be able to do a little bit later. Oh, I completely forgot about one thing. Be right back. I almost completely forgot about the fact that I can still slice my own hand off. So that's what I fully intend to do. Ow! 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 Oh shit! Unfortunately, I'm not as invincible as I had originally hoped. Ow, 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 ow! Fuck, now I gotta get this guy re-sewn back on. Ah, oh, Crap. Okay. Maybe I better pass on magic for a little while, eh? After all, if I'm only one-handed, this is really going to be fucking painful. Just remember again, as you can see, there's my hand. Ow! Bloody hell, that hurt. Ugh. Not to worry. I'll find a way. A re... Ah! 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 Fuck! Ah! Ah! <sighs> ah. Wipe the blood off. And once again... I'm completely clear, as you can see, and I've been able to uh, put the ring back on as well. That was the... Okay, so there we go. My hands are back to normal now, but a little reminder to people, don't try these tricks at home. They hurt like fucking hell every time you do them. Those are my tricks of trying to bodily dismember myself. I hope you enjoyed. Toodles!